Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if spatial sound is appearing to revert back to Windows Sonic sound upon rebooting or hibernating your computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So we are going to start off by opening up the search menu. Type in Control Panel, Best Match, or come back with Control Panel. Go ahead and open that up. You want to set your view by in the top right to large icons, and then you want to go down and select sound. Select the playback tab, which should be the one that takes you to immediately, and then select your speaker option in here, or whatever your speaker output is, and then select properties. It may be microphone as well, so just keep that in mind. It might necessarily be called speakers, but regardless, now you want to go over to spatial sound. And you want to click on the drop down here underneath spatial sound format. Select the spatial sound format you want to apply. Click on the drop down. And if you want to select, for example, Dolby Atmos, you can select that there. Uh, otherwise, you can switch it to something other than Windows Sonic for headphones. And then once you're done, you would select apply and OK to save that change. And then you'd also want to go into the advanced tab here and under exclusive mode, you want to uncheck the option where it says allow applications to take exclusive control of this device. Go ahead and uncheck that option and then select apply and OK. And then once you are done with that, you want to go ahead and close out of here. And you want to open up the search menu. Type in settings, best match, or come back with settings. Go ahead and open that up. On the left side, you want to select apps. And then on the right side, you want to select installed apps. In the search apps field, just go ahead and search for Adobe Access or DTS Sound Unbound. Again, depending on which spatial sound format you are, are intending on using. And if it's a different one, then go ahead and search for that one instead. And then once you found it in the list, you want to go ahead and click the three dotted arrow next to the entry, select advanced options. And then you would scroll down underneath reset. If this app isn't working right, we can try to repair it. The app's data won't be affected. Select repair. And then if you're still having an issue, you can select the second option here. If the app still isn't working right, reset it. The app's data will be deleted. Go ahead and select reset. And then select reset again. And then once that's done, close out of here. Open up the search menu, type in device manager. Best result, should come back with device manager. So go ahead and open that up. Double click on the sound, video, and game controller section. And then right click on your audio device listed under here and select update driver. Select browse my computer for drivers. And then select, let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. And then select the one that's listed in here. And then next, select yes, and then close out of here. If you want to go online and search up your specific sound card drivers you know, from your manufacturer, you're welcome to do that as well. However, if you're just trying to do a quick solution here potentially, then I would recommend just trying it this way at first. And we're going to go ahead and restart our computer. And there you go, guys. Pretty straightforward process. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.